one thing mi wacha ni address mimi nimekuwa member hiyo bunge la mwananchi na niliacha kwenda hapo wakati niliona imeacha kuwa bunge la mwananchi imekuwa bunge la ODM we have been there tumeona tunajaribu kuongea you raise issues there you raise real issues they make noise they hickle they don't want anything najua vijana wako pale mnataka kushai na kina gaucho mnaona wanashai na kina nuru okanga ani bloggers mnajengea kazi ni we ni youth uko pale unaenda kuongea vibaya about kiongozi unaenda kuongea vibaya about inchi yako we mwenyewe jiulize inakusaidia aje wakati tunaongea vibaya about that now you are talking about the king ni mbaya ni, mulo, ni muongo ni mtapili amefanya amefanya we mwenyewe jiulize how does it translate into your own life so acha tu wakati tunafanya vitu vingine pia tujiangalie we mind our own security sasa tu mara sasa wakati ume, umeenda pale umeongea vibaya umeshikwa unaanza kulia serikali na inaniandama that aside let's come back to the king visit one thing about that visit as a success ukiangalia international community imeanza kuwa na hope na imekuwa na trust na security agencies wa Kenya so Kenya as a nation ime earn global trust ukiangalia the level of security ambayo king alikuja nayo si kama yenye tunge expect atukupata hizo ma traffic jam tumefungiwa mabarabara network jam atu mara simu aziend through we had a very smooth that everything was as normal so that shows that the international community has a very good intention and has very big trust in Kenyan security agencies that's one the second one i would like to say that it's it's na uh, what like what our deputy president said to a rich attraction a king riding on a that tuk tuk will attract more more invest uh, more investors more tourists that will translate to economic growth of this country so it's a it's an economic it's an economic tap that visit international a state visit is a economic economic tap so i'd say that this visit was a success and We, it's, a, it's a milestone for our country mm. it's showing that the international community has full trust in the kenyan government as i uh, as i have told you you even saw babarela morodinga at state house that shows even himself have agreed that now we have a government in place we have a state that in place and we are, we are, the things are things are going to, to roll down as they are planned so the visit was an eye opener mm. kwa wale watu ambao wanasema oh sijui some azimio mp should be dewept from off their seats but you know that baba was there and it was a state visit that shows that baba also recognizes the state so i don't see i think now they should also revisit those harsh decisions they are making on mps who visit state house and now start seeing that yes, sir now that we have a government in place we should work with the government of the people because uh, when when things get out of hand we hear them call the government oh serikali fanyi kazi serikali idea if you don't work with that serikali how will it help you so i would say i would that the 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 king's visit is a success and that's a big win for Kenya. Yes. Okay, Jana Maina Njega uh, alikuwa na toa speech akaweza kutetea uh, governor wa Matangi and a lot of people were shocked I, and I was also surprised. What happens? Unajua siasa ya ina the king turn. Nimekuambia sasa siasa is not is not dynamic static. Ina kanga ikichange. Now that people have started have started aligning themselves preparing themselves for 2027 election mm. people have now it has stuck in their mind that you have a government in place there's no elections there's no rigging there's no everything mm. so now people have started aligning themselves for 2027 election mm. and as uh, uh, I'm also from Mount Kenya region mm. we as Mount Kenya we want to have a unity of purpose mm. now we don't want to talk about party we don't have we don't want to talk about anything we want to focus on our unity our, we put everything aside now we focus on our unity and what is good for our people so as maina jenga said let's all come together let's hold each other and we also have everyone has their weaknesses uh, let's not take advantage of that let's correct each other and we march forward yes don't you think hiyo imemuongeza a plus plus because uh, watu wanasema yenda nataka kuwa mount kenya king pina nataka kutoa gachagua nataka kutoa ndimi nyoro okay about the king king kingship thing i would want to talk more about it because that was the thing yenye ilifanya ukaona kumekuwa ni kama kuna uhasama between uru kenyata na and other leaders so current what i would say is that the the kingship comes on itself you don't force things you you do, you do what is supposed to be done and that will follow you so any anyone who wants to be a kingpin in mount kenya hakuna haja kuvunja mwingine migundi wewe kuwe kingpin let's now come together we focus do what bet, do what you can do better to sell yourself without focusing on others and with that the kingship will come automatically yeah 
you might even be surprised kupata hiyo hiyo kingship inatoka kwa mtu mwingine tofauti apart from hao mtu unaona kwa picture because kuna watu wengi wamekuwa wakifanya vitu mingi sana pale Mount Kenya region as you can see kama ukiingia pale Morango unapata kuna businessmen wengi sana watu ambao wana focus mm. maybe na mambo ya education ya watu wa pale nini nini they have created employment for so many people there are people we call opinion shapers Unaweza una, kaa pale tu hapa tunakuwa opinion shape ambaye anaweza kuwa king. Unajua tu kuna ile tofauti ya kuwa king na kuna king maker. A king maker is more powerful, more spiritual and more enlightened than a king. So kuna wale maybe wako pale wanagangana ngangana, they will end up being king makers and they will, they will make someone else a king. Yes. So in your own opinion, do you think or don't you think governor Wamatangi should be impeached? the impeachment nini thing i wouldn't want to talk about it more because i'm not a, a kambu resident i'm not a staff of the county na and, as, as you can see we're only waiting for the mcs to bring the allegations mm -hmm. then now we can peruse through them then then the the relevant bodies can follow, can make the follow up but as for now i think governors should be given time mm -hmm. since this is their first year in office this is their first budget that they are assuming so i think the governor should now be given time and maybe be judged mm. as as per, per their first budget mm. yes there is war in kisi between simbarati and osoro juzi uh, osoro people people say that osoro mwenyewe ndio alituma gsu in conjunction with the president william ruto one thing na frayanga sana nikisikia watu waki drag jina ya william ruto kwa vitu kidogo kidogo those are very petty issues mm. william ruto is a man of integrity 